Are you ready to face the intensity? Today on Package Food Gourmet, we're gonna turn Takis into taquitos. The first step is to make the Takis into tortillas. Add them into a food processor and grind them up until you have one cup of crumbles. Add one cup of corn flour to the food processor with the ground up Takis and blend until combined. It should take about 30 seconds, which is plenty of time to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We post a new video every Thursday at 2 p.m. Pacific time. Put the mixture into a bowl and add 1 quarter teaspoon of salt and 1 cup of warm water, then stir. Slowly add in another 3 quarters of a cup of water and 2 thirds of a cup of all-purpose flour. The gluten in the flour helps the tortillas roll more easily without cracking. Your dough should be soft but not too sticky. You can add more flour or water as needed. Portion out the dough and roll it into golf ball size rounds. We're going to cover these up and let them rest for a few minutes while we start the filling. Breaded tenders work really well for this recipe because they add a delicious flavor. Tell me in the comments what your favorite flavor of taquito is. Air fry or bake the tenders until they are fully cooked, then in a pan add 6 ounces of cream cheese, half a cup of salsa, and an eighth of a cup or one package of taco seasoning and mix it over low heat. Once the tenders are cool enough, chop them into small pieces and add them to the pan. Grate one cup of Monterey Jack cheese, toss that in, and admire the amazing cheesy goodness you have created. Lightly grease another skillet and put it over low heat. Uncover your dough balls and put them in between two sheets of parchment paper. You don't need a tortilla press to make these, so if you don't have one, no worries. Just use your countertop and a cutting board to flatten them out. Transfer the tortillas to a pan and turn the heat to medium. Cook for about 45 seconds per side. You want them to be soft, not crunchy. When they're done, you can start rolling. Add about 2 inches of oil to the pan and keep the heat on medium. Peanut and safflower oil work well for frying. Take your tortillas and add some filling, then carefully roll your taquitos. Once you have some ready and your oil is hot, carefully place them seam down into the pan. Cook for a few minutes per side until they are light brown and crispy. These are now ready to serve on their own or you can top them with taco sauce or any dip you like. Just make sure to let them cool because they'll be very hot. I am telling you, 7-Eleven's got nothing on these and the only regret you'll have after eating them is that you didn't make more. Ooh. We have taquitos. These look really good. These are awesome. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you like really them? Good. So they're taquitos, as in uh -huh. takis and taquitos. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Better than takis, I think. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Hands down. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for stopping by, and I'll see you next week.